you this then. With everything that you have going on with this song, what other projects are you also working on? Are you working on an album? Are you working on, what else are you doing to enhance okay. this? So you asked about my songwriting process and one thing that Electric Point, my producer said is, you have to build momentum. You have to put your next song out like ASAP. And you know, when I, when I started and I moved out to LA, I brought this book with me and it is full of just lyric ideas. Ooh, my friend Casey will love this. She came to visit me in LA and we had a songwriting session, but I didn't, I was in the middle of moving out and I'd already shipped my car full of all my stuff. So we used my old mail to take notes. <laughs> oh, that's great. <laughs> you know, you really are truly a natural talent. Oh, thank you, Anthony. <laughs> while, while, while writing the song, I kind of started 75. Yeah, so I have lots of ideas to answer that question. Nothing is currently in the works, but um, I've been focusing all my time and attention on this project. Um, you're, you know, you're so creative and you know, you're so knowledgeable you know, on so many things that um, I, I always say, be the very, very best you can be. And you fit that to, you know, to the- To capacity, absolutely. always, always. Everything for Thank you. all the time that Elise and I have known you, you have always gone above and beyond and you have always been the very best you could be and more. And we so admire that in you. Absolutely. Well, you know, you know we love you guys. Oh, that's so nice to hear. I love you guys 100%. so much too. There's a, there's a discipline for passion. I was watching a clip of, of Oprah and Lady Gaga um, from a summit they were at a few months ago and I wrote it down. Uh, Oprah was saying, there's a discipline for passion and it's not about how many times you get rejected or you fall down or get beaten up. It's about how many times you stand up and are brave and you keep on going. And I'm, I so believe in that and I've believed in that probably ever since the day I moved to New York City. I'm so happy I started this whole creative journey with modeling because that made my skin so tough at an early-ish age that I was able to handle all the rejection that, you know, the music or the modeling industry, which then led to acting. There's so much rejection in the acting industry as well. Like, if I... If, this, if these past like seven years of living in New York City were for nothing, they sure as hell built my bones strong and I found the love of my life in the process. Uh, yes, you uh, did. And met some awesome yes, people. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. It's been, a, it's been a really cool journey. And I'm like, you, like you're asking, what's next? I honestly have no idea, but I'll be sure. You'll be the first to know <laughs> when I do. <laughs> <laughs> well, we will talk about it. Things That's are constantly it. evolving up here. So. That's awesome. Well, good for you. Good for you. We wish you the best. We're proud of you. We're happy for you. And we'll help you in any way we possibly can. That's the truth. Right back at you. <laughs> right you. back at you. Thank you so much for talking with me. Always. And for asking all the right questions. I hope that you all stay safe, stay healthy, and stay you crazy. Do. Always. <laughs> stay crazy. <laughs> we love you. We love you, Thomas. Take care, my friend. I love you guys.